hello guys welcome to the new video so in today's videos we are demonstrate a new project so the project name is house rent management systems we have made this project using php and mysql so i uh, just explain the details of this project and then after that we are going to demonstrate the complete project what exactly uh, inside this project so like this project is a house rented management systems this is the home page of that project and the project descriptions we will check the overview of the project so we have made this project using the php and mysql this project is a web based application you can use this project only on your uh, desktop like this is a web based application so you need to chrome or any web browser that uh, that used to serve the websites the key features of this projects are admin dashboard we have an admin admin dashboard house type management and in house management tenant management and the payment and the reporting these are the key features of this project and then after that some details about these features like admin admin can access all the functionality of this project like editing deleting or any updations admin can do this project is user friendly so uh, like the interface of this project are very very unique and uh, very smooth so that you are not uh, uh, you do, you do not need any update in the ui it's a good and smooth ui house types uh, in when the admin are going to add the house then they are the house categories like what type of house you are going to add in this and then the house management inside the house management we are going to add or delete any house and then provide the details and the rent of that house and now the tent in the in the tent in that in in the in this uh, we are going to add uh, the users that are going to be added the house and then payment of that details inside the payment management we have the payment also payment option but we are not using any uh, like online payment method or any integration of the payment but you uh, we are just using a demo payment uh like uh, the payment is added and then that it will send to the database and then after that we can create the report of that payment but if you want to you can add any payment integration in the inside the between like here uh, before sending the data to the database you can add any payment integration if you want to like add or if you have any payment integration and next in the last uh, there is a report section that uh, is generate a report of the monthly payment or monthly income and monthly sales that are in 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 the last it generate the monthly and the total uh, total sales of that month and last uh, we require the softwares we require the software php and uh, mysql and the workbench currently i am using a jam server for the mysql jam but you can use workbench also if you have a workbench for the uh, for editing the code or for the tool that i am using for the editing is a vs code and web server we need an apache server or hardware for the hardware you do not need uh, you do not need any specific hardware only the things is that uh, you uh, your system should be uh, your your system should have a space while running this project now we are going to next we are going to demonstrate and initialization steps so now let's start the project so our project is starting from here it's a code of complete project and the database is also here the database files are here and then these are completely files of this project now as this is the code of uh, this is the core part now i'm just uh, showing the uh, ui part of this code now when you start the project you navigate to this home page now after that you have to log in as a admin only the admin have the access of all these things like admin can do all the performance admin have all the rights to delete edit any payment any house anything admin can do all the things i'm just explaining this because uh, if you are willing to buy this project or if you are interested to make this project so make the project according to this type not just basic only so just open this admin and now the admin uh 
use an admin username and password here we have three cards that are going to display our details total house total total tenants and total payment of this month if i click this view payment it will display me all the payment details if i click this it will display me total user if i click here it will display me the total houses so just i uh, select the house type here i can add the any category if i want to add the category of house like if i want to add a uh, uh, 2 bhk and then save so it is added here automatically 2 bhk i can add it and i can delete also if i want to add a uh, delete now the house i can add the house also currently we have only two houses if i want to add a new house i just add r112 this is a 2 bhk description of this house is uh, provided bed and kitchens and all these things and the price of this uh, house is 2500 and then we have added this house it's added in the list before that we have only two project uh, two houses now we added the recent one new third one okay now if if a user want to add it or if if an if an admin want to edit this house or delete this house they can add from here or delete from here now the it is a list of the tenants who are going to interested in the house so i just select the house name rishab okay name decode it and then first name is updatekar.com email we have used test contact number now currently it's showing the two houses because two houses are left only if i select this one and then next time if i am going to buy or if i going to searching a new houses then it will display only the one house currently it's showing the two houses because two houses are left if i select r213 and then the registration date is this and then save now r12 is assigned to this user and the monthly payment is this and currently this user don't pay any payment we can check here the payment detail is blank and if now if i added a new user and then you can check only the one house is left so this also the automatically update and delete all the houses that are fully booked or that are currently in use with some user so it will not display that here now the payment details i can add the payment details also like if i select new entry then i have to select the user and currently i select this user so after selecting the user it will display me all the details of that user total payment is currently zero out balance is zero payment monthly zero monthly rent pay to 5000 2500 so just add the invoice uh, invoice is v1 and amount paid is 2500 and then paid okay now after payment you can check that uh, the user uh, that user have paid the payment and automatically the date will display here the date and the payment are automatically added in this uh, table and also you can check the invoice of this payment after selecting this and uh, the total paid this out balance is this and monthly payable is zero so it's added automatically here we can generate a report also uh, here like as i said you earlier you can add the payment method here if you have any integration payment integrated uh, like paypal or any rosep so you can add that payment method here before like if i select the entry then you can add the real time payment method here now we are going to just in the last report section we have in two report section one is for monthly and one is for rent balance report we check one by one uh, view report it display the total user and the total payment so in this month we have collected 
70,500 uh, 70, rupees. We can print if I want to print and here is an filter of monthly payment. If I want to, if if a user want, if an admin want to check the April, then it will display no data because in April we do not have any data. In May we have two data, so it displaying here. We can print if I want to print that here, then I can print whole if I can print it also the data is displaying correctly okay now back to the report then report and re rental balance report check the rental balance report it displays the more detail of the payment like monthly payment how much payable amount this paid kitna uh, how much he have paid outstanding balance and last payment how uh, on on which date the user has paid last payment so this is all about the house rental management systems if a user or a student want to update anything or if a student are interested to buy or want to develop uh, this project by at your end then they can contact me if a user want to save their time and he don't have any time to develop this project then he can purchase this project from me i will do all the setups in your systems just check the descriptions of this video or you can also check this project from this website updategar.com and then after that you can search this project here. If you are new to the channel please subscribe to our channel. Thank you for